welcome to vlogmas day 10 so far so good we are trying we are cruising nicely except for the fact that i wasn't able to post a daily vlog on uh, day 6 day 7 and 8 i compressed them in one vlog because i didn't have time I already explained what happened in the previous vlog which I hope you have watched because it is vlogmas this is going to be an indoors vlog might step out later in the day to do some restocking uh, of uh, some food stuff oh, I can even I can even do that tomorrow so if I don't have the energy, I'll just chill in the house and rest because this week has been an eventful week. So many activities, office parties, kids, Christmas party. Uh, you combine that with work and other engagements. Oh, so much, so much going on. You know, it is Christmas and uh, there's so many things going on as we conclude the year. But Yugalia has been trying to balance whatever she is doing. At least I have been creating time to like shoot some content. Even if not the perfect content that you'd wish to get from me. We will get there. We will get there my people. Trust the process. Trust the process. We will get there. We will get there. I remember mentioning in the previous vlog that next year I will give this YouTube channel my best so as i give my best make sure that you are supporting on the other end by subscribing if you haven't subscribed to this channel and subscription is free yes you just tap on the red button you see on the right side of the, of the screen you click on it that's how you subscribe for free then you put your notification button on so that you can always get notified whenever I post a new video, a new vlog, new content. Living alone diaries, living alone wahala. This toothpaste has been having a missing lead for the last one week plus. Luckily, it's still good, it's still okay. You see this? Yeah, it's still okay. So I dropped it some day when I was in a hurry. I tried looking for it, I could not find it. Then today as I was cleaning the carpet right next to the TV, I don't know how it got there, I can't really tell, but I found it, I found it. So, let's go ahead and brush these teeth. When you are living alone, some things don't bother you. Like if you lose something, it is still within the house, you will find it when it wants to be found, okay? Imagine having a scar on your face, somewhere visible like this. That is how you learn how to embrace your flaws fearlessly. <laughs> so, I've been walking with my head high with this scar right here. Thank God it's finally healed. Hmm. Because how can we cross over to a New Year scar? No way. I serve a living God. Huh? My God is great though. My God is great. So, Vaseline has been of great help. At least I apply a small amount on the wound before I go to bed. And it just helped us turn the healing process. And baby girl is happy, finally. Hmm. Finally. It's still visible, but it's healed. At least it is healed. We are almost there. And of course, sunscreen. Sunscreen is a must. Must have, must use on a daily basis. If you want to have good skin, flawless skin, even if you are in the process of healing your skin, a sunscreen is a must have, must use on a daily basis. If you don't have any option in mind and want to purchase a sunscreen, then go for this one. This one is a good purchase, it's affordable and uh, it has shine control and a modifying effect such that when you apply it on your face like I have done, your face is not like over shining. You can actually 
do some uh, moisturizer then the sunscreen and you walk out of the house confidently so you can try it too it's a good one i highly highly recommend this one an inspiration to the content creators who are just launching their content creation journey when you're starting please be sober be sober and don't focus on the two three four five views you're getting after putting in so much work uh, shooting editing and uploading your content content creation is a journey and before you break even it's it's like a business you have to build it for a, a prolonged period of time to a certain point so after a certain duration that's when you will start uh, seeing profits that's when you will start seeing like your hard work is finally paying off so myself i've been like motivating myself to continue with this vlogmas series because the viewership is not that good you waste a lot of you spend not waste you spend a lot of time uh, shooting editing even coming up with the idea of what you're going to include in whatever you're shooting it is also work it requires energy it requires concentration it requires resources so i'm trusting the process i'm trusting the process people we stick at it until we are done with vlogmas as a content creator whenever you're shooting your content always have the future in front of you like you look at the future and you're like the future is bright i know finally someday my hard work will surely pay off and it will the power of manifestation speak good things upon yourself wish yourself the best because you deserve the best if you don't deserve the best then if you don't wish yourself well then who will finally i have let this not less bright out I've been rocking that big bun at the middle here since the time I braided this hair. It's been like two weeks. So it is time for a change. It is time for a change. So I'm trying to figure out how I will be rocking this hair now for the next one, one week. Oh, this hair is still intact. In, in fact, I can even like go for another two weeks with the same hair because it is it is nice and the way this hair was braided ah it was braided by a skilled person the lady did an amazing job so by the time by the time we get to tomorrow morning I will have figured out how I'm gonna tie this hair yes i've been learning several options from tiktok like tiktok is not just about dancing and shaking body uh, uh, you can also learn a few tricks here and there a few life hacks how to do stuff actually even how to maneuver your career path so it all depends with how you spend your time in these uh, social media uh, platforms. At least make it resourceful as you entertain yourself, educate yourself to make yourself better. It's around 6.30 in the evening. Baby girl here is refreshed, energized after enjoying a serious nap of two hours. Like I did some house chores, then I was like, this body needs to rest. So I took a shower and off I went to my bed and enjoyed a serious nap of two hours. So now I feel refreshed. I feel re-energized and it is time to have my dinner. Today I was craving some ugali, cabbage and uh, eggs on the side scrambled eggs so this is what i'm having for dinner today 
Let's dig in. In Africa, we don't eat ugali with a spoon. No. We don't eat ugali with a spoon. So what normally happens is you cut a piece of ugali, then you mold it, then you put your stew, whatever you're accompanying it with, and enjoy. Mm. So in Africa, you don't eat ugali with a spoon. This is how you do it. You cut a piece of ugali, then you mold it through something like this. Then you dig in in your stew, whatever you're accompanying your ugali with. And ha uh ha. -huh. You enjoy. now it is time to get organized after enjoying my dinner let me fold this clothes at least i managed to wash uh, some yesterday i still had some energy because i knew when we get to today i won't manage like washing all the clothes in one day so let's do this Ooh, yeah. guys we are currently experiencing a serious blackout i do not understand what is happening in this country because uh we've been having like a blackout twice every week which is not good imagine blackout during a weekend how boring that weekend is so meanwhile you can call me madam backup plan because i have to see i gotta see so here my backup plan is coming through perfectly it's helping save the situation oh,